Tonight we were given exclusive access by Fairfax County Police, showing us the equipment that's used to do blood transfusions quickly in the case of an emergency. When tragedy strikes at a crime scene or when there's a bad crash on the highway, seconds count. You ready? And that's why this technology could save lives. I think it's a game changer. So says Officer Eric Acevedo and Dr. Carrie Scandlebury from Fairfax County Police. This is what is actually keeping the blood cold. It's a way to transfuse blood while on the move. The device uses a heating mechanism to bring the blood from near freezing levels to body temperature in seconds. You can feel kind of, hold it over here, how warm that went. This technique, commonly used by the military, is increasingly being used by first responders. And while many EMS crews are now equipped with this technology, Fairfax County is now one of the first police agencies to carry the device. Back in May, these portable kits were brought onto the county helicopter. We have the blood equipment here. And starting this month, they'll be given to medical officers traveling with their tactical units. Think SWAT teams responding to barricades or mass shootings. When we're talking about active violence situations, having our TAC medics carrying whole blood could literally be the difference between life and death in that type of scenario. All in all, the county has three of these kits, costing about $2,000 a piece. Since they were purchased in May, they've been used six times to help patients. Now we're told that all of the blood used in these transfusions comes from Inova Hospital, and local police is telling us that if you want to help out this holiday, they are in need and you should donate. Reporting here in Fairfax County, Evan Kozloff, WUSA 9.